Today we are reviewing some of the most hyped up TikTok shop products. Why is the bottle already half gone? I'm not gonna lie, it's just kind of choking me, but... Mmm, oh, mm-hmm. Do be hooding. The lips look like as if they just got lip filler. We are starting off strong with probably the most popular TikTok brand on TikTok shop right now. This is the College at Night Wrapping Mask by Medicube. This is why I wrap my face. That overnight face mask makes me wake up with skin that makes me look like a porcelain doll. What I'm most curious about is if people are genuine about the results of this product. Is there a beauty filter on? Does it really look like glass skin? Does your skin actually look poreless? Because let me tell you, the people on TikTok, skin looked a little too perfect. The total for this order came out to $20. First impressions, why is the bottle already half gone? It almost just seems like someone decided to use this on the way to me. Now I understand maybe they wanted to give it a try themselves. And you're actually supposed to have done your skincare routine already. So as you can see, that's why my skin looks really oily and like kind of juicy. Ooh, that feels really good though. It has a really strong smell that I don't like like, a, like alcohol. So far this feels really nice on the skin. Put on about two, three layers. At this point, I'm gonna go in like with one more on this side. I'm resembling one special Squidward. I will say this is not something you want to put on maybe when you're like sleeping with your boyfriend for the first time They do say the more crazy you look the night before the prettier you'll wake up the next morning So let's hope that's the same case mask is finally starting to harden a bit <laughs> You know what I'm more concerned about the fact that shark tales is speaking exactly what I'm feeling lately I want, I want to be a somebody why is that so real? I want to be a somebody, but I am a somebody already and I keep forgetting that and not a somebody to millions Somebody to my family and friends, you know, I always manage to incorporate that deep message and that's the deep message for today Just woke up guys, so please Oh my gosh, okay Maybe I am being like kind of fooled because my skin doesn't look or feel feel as pretty. The mask was like drying up my eyelid. That's why they look really swollen right now. I'm just gonna wash off the rest of this. This is my skin after I wash it all off. It's a bit scary there for a second. I have come to the consensus that most people on TikTok are only showing you what they look like after the mask is applied because it does look really shiny and glossy. They're definitely not showing you after sleeping with it. This part of my skin, like where specifically my cheekbones are, you can see a bit of glow and it does feel really smooth. Like I do see the difference in my skin. It, it does feel very poreless. That's exactly what I wanted. Do you want to try the mask? <laughs> On to the next viral TikTok product. The next product I'm reviewing has the potential to diminish one of my biggest insecurities. And all it takes is a contraption device that looks like a chicken. This is the V-Line Face Slimming Strap. Your jaw is getting snatched as you're wearing this. And not only that, it's like, it lifts your face. It's supposed to help your nasolobial fold, if I said that correctly, and help lift your face and get rid of your double chin. I saw so many, so many. And I don't know what my free page was trying to tell me. TikToks on this. On TikTok, this item has a 4.4 rating with almost 30,000 products sold. Everyone on TikTok was promoting it as a product that could help get rid of or diminish the look of your double chin. And if you guys know, this and it's really not one that I've ever been like, oh, I need surgical. I mean, I thought about it, which is ridiculous, but more so just like, it's not that big of a deal. It's there, it's skin. Am I just curious to see if this could work? Because like, if all I have to do is wear this, my double chin's gone, so be it. Now I'm gonna take some before and after pictures. The double chin really comes through at this angle. <laughs> also from like the bottom angles that's why i never put myself in that position i try not to where someone can view me from the bottom it usually shouldn't be the case anyways it does say for your first application use it for only 15 minutes so we are going to do this to apply the strap it's actually really easy this part goes under your chin because these little thingamabobs which i don't know they're just they look like black circles to me but somehow they have some properties and you just take these two little Velcro part. One goes over the other. Am I doing this right? This is wrong. I did something wrong. Just kidding. Who was 
three to five times a day to wear this for 15 minutes like what if i'm at work yeah i guess you could just wear this while you're like driving that could be really convenient like, you know right before a date or something like that i'm not gonna lie this is kind of choking me but <laughs> Shark tails. <laughs> Ow. Ah. I would not recommend talking as I am right now. Your circulation or something feels cut off. The 15 minutes is up, which means I can breathe now. Oh. Ah. Ooh. Oh, it was sweaty in there. Apparently, after the first use, these little marks go away. Like, do I look slimmer, guys? Please tell me I do. Not that big of a difference, I'm not gonna lie. Which is a little bit disappointing. Skin still there. I had to come back and give this an honest review. As you can see, I'm using it in this very moment. It's not a very cutesy look, let me tell you that. I feel like people claim that after your first try, aka like your first 15 minutes, you're gonna see a noticeable difference. I don't necessarily think that's 100% true. <laughs> you know what, we're gonna have to take this off. Oh, okay. It's similar to a gua sha where I feel like the more consistently you do it, you will actually start to see results. I feel like even doing this once a day could potentially bring results. Maybe doing this twice every other day could work. I actually started to see some results after using this for the past three days. I mean, I feel like I see a difference. I'll insert some photos here. So that could also just be delusion. Overall, I think this is kind of a slay. We're gonna switch things up. You love to munch like me. You probably see the Samyang glass noodles on your furry page all the time. If one thing gets me on TikTok shop, it is the food. Especially when I watch a good mukbang. Oh. <laughs> love spicy noodles. There was a time where I was eating them a little too much. Ruined my stomach, for sure. I'd be in an exam the next morning. Literally need to go in the middle of the exam. True story. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> Now it's just to close the lid halfway and microwave for two minutes. So once it gets to the last 30 seconds, I'm gonna add some cheese in there. Mmm, smells dangerously good. Now we add in powder. I am given two packs of powder, but I'm gonna go kind of like one by one because sometimes I don't like it to be too powdery. Definitely put probably too much liquid, like a little bit more waterier than it probably should be. We're gonna add half of the second pack. Do you see this? Mmm. My mouth was watering a little too much. Mmm. Oh, mm-hmm. I didn't even, it didn't even get in my mouth yet and I was excited. Mmm. Way spicier than I thought they were gonna be. Do you need to cook the noodles more? Like, is that how it's supposed to be? Yeah, maybe they are supposed to be cooked a little more. I give this a solid, like, a three. Thanks to this, I'll probably be on the bathroom for the next 30 minutes. It would not be a TikTok review without makeup products. Even before TikTok, a shop was even a thing. I was way too easily persuaded to buy things from people's beauty product review videos. It was actually bad to the point where I was buying a product from Sephora like every other week just from watching a video. I was ashamed. I actually deleted TikTok for that reason. That being said, I've actually only bought three things from the TikTok shop beauty section. We are gonna start off with this concealer brush. This is the 8506 angle hot and flashy bk brush if you guys are on the makeup side of tiktok you know this brush and how raved about it was i've actually used this a couple times and i'm not gonna lie i thought it was a little overhyped i'm going to use this brush and compare it to my beauty blender and really determine if one really needs this if it's as mind-blowing and life-changing as people claim it is we're gonna use this brush on this side of the eye do i necessarily think this is a life-changing product like you need it actually maybe <laughs> now that i'm using it right now it's doing a really good job that's kind of looking really well okay we're gonna switch over to the other side and use the 
beauty blender i actually don't wet this so this could easily give this same kind of effect this one actually has like no creases on this side and then this side has a little crease but i want to say it looks more full coverage i do believe that before this makeup brush came into my life i wasn't missing out on anything but it does do a great job at blending out the makeup like i think that if you're wanting a concealer brush that does a really good job it does satisfy that makeup application type of thing but i don't think that it makes everything 10 times better now this product it is highly rated so far the highest rated product that we've reviewed so far has a 4.7 nearly 108,000 sold products i do think that this will be used a lot more frequently from here on out we're actually going to go in with a lip product next this is the glasting melting balm by rom and nd this has 8,500 sold products with a 4.7 star review the selling point of this product is, is that it fills in your lines and i have really dry lips you guys probably already know that because always on camera specifically in their like product review pictures the lips look like as if they just got lip filler this could be a scam where it's like well the person actually has lip filler already so that's why it looks so smooth and glossy or this actually fills in the lines as people claim it does here are my lips before a little dry colorless this is what the product looks like it's kind of like a lipstick kind oh <laughs> wait it's kind of good already <laughs> yeah Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Right off the bat, the feeling of this is definitely like no other lip product that I have. It just went on really smoothly. It's like very buildable. Doesn't necessarily fill in the lines, but I think me saying that I don't have a product like this says that it is potentially life-changing. The cost of this was like $13. If you don't have a lot of lip products, this is definitely one that you could really benefit from using. Plus it's on the more affordable side we have some rem rem beauty so i bought a trio pack of liquid eyeshadow this product was very popular because of this shade here this is femba I just remember seeing this girl wearing it in her inner corner and maybe on her eyelids a bit and it looks so good that's why i bought it we're gonna apply this shade in comet first i'm actually gonna apply it on the back of my hand because these are so super pigmented like look at that on tiktok shop this product goes from 51 dollars to 30 dollars so it's discounted supposedly it has a 4.6 star rating with 2436 sold definitely more of a gold undertone that's really pretty this shade though is so beautiful i've never seen anything like it here we go we're just gonna put this in the inner corner this may look like i'm going to rave for the rest of the day and can you guys see that it's kind of insane how pigmented i think if you're going for a night out this is one of the eyeshadows you want to use and it's so convenient to use i'm gonna show you guys the end makeup result <laughs> Trying on the eyeshadow again, I feel like this either slays or it gives Claire's makeup. I just feel like my eyeshadow is not coming out like that one girl's video. It just looks really good on her eyes. Maybe not on mine. Let me know if this is just me. And on camera, it actually kind of eats, but um, on some parts of the eyelids, it's a little bit separated. <laughs> We are on to the last two items. Don't think it would be a proper TikTok review if I did not buy some of their most sold fashion items. You're gonna start off with this hoodie. This is the Fayable Fashion Fade Craft Unisex Casual Oversized Acid Wash Tops Hoodie Pullover. You know what? Some of these names are just so long for absolutely no reason. This hoodie is an acid wash type of look and I wholeheartedly did not think that was gonna be the case. Having my suspicions, I really thought they just used some random product pictures and slapped it on there so I did did think this hoodie was gonna be kind of like a solid wash. I don't hate it. It's grew on me. If you like the look of secondhand hoodies, you know, you maybe just picked it up from Goodwill. That's kind of what you're getting with this. What I love most about this hoodie is the fit. I did pick up a medium. After wearing it, it has definitely gone into its hoodie form. When I first opened the package, it was literally compressed, uh, which I've never received a hoodie like that so it made it really wrinkly but i'm very impressed and i didn't want to be it's really thick it's soft on the outside there's a little bit of fleece inside which i don't mind that it's not excessive because because as a sweater as a sweater as a sweater a lot of fleece is not good for me at some point it feels like i'm just dripping sweat this is actually the perfect amount of coziness their price point goes from 38 dollars 
to $49 if you want to be technical, $37.99. And so I don't really know where that fluctuation, like what that's for. But my total for this came out to $43.11. If I had to give this a review myself, I would give this a solid 4.5 out of 5 do be hooding moving on to our last product of this video which is this red little side bag it's grown on me guys because of first impressions i know what this is gonna smell like because i could smell it through this bag not gonna lie this bag really does slike i mean once you get past the fish smell it's again it stank, but it is really cute. A really pretty red color, super cute for the fall time. I already started using this as well. I took it on my trip with me to Ernie. You know what? Let's test if this could fit a computer though. Oh. Okay, so if you were to use this as like a school bag, I don't think you could fit your computer horizontally, definitely vertically. We'll have it sticking out just a bit. So it could be a cute little school bag. I don't necessarily think that I would use it just because, you know, you could really only fit your computer and then maybe a few pencils, a small notebook. You do get one big pocket here with the button. Fit some things in here. You also get one zipper inside. I wouldn't say it's the best for organization wise, like if you're fine with just throwing all your stuff in your bag, like kind of have to like dig for all your things. But if that literally does not matter to you, then this is your bag. This also came out to be a whopping $21. I want to note that a lot of the pricing is being shot up because of the shipping. I didn't even realize I paid $8 for shipping. Not stupid. Without the shipping, it's nearly $13. I would recommend if you're ever gonna buy things on TikTok shop and you have a few things in mind, I would wait to buy all of them maybe in one because I think you get free shipping if you spend a certain amount. That is our last TikTok shop review. Oh, so much fun. Hopefully this video has helped any of you guys that have been thinking about buying from TikTok shop, anyone who's been on the fence about a certain product, maybe it was one of the products in this video, or has just been a little unconvinced that every product is as good as the people say it. I wanted to give my honest thoughts, opinion, and kind of just let you guys know that these items are good, but they're not life-changing. If you guys are interested in any of these products, I will attempt to leave some links down below. They may be commission links, but again, you don't have to buy them. I will see you guys in the next video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you want me to do some more of these videos, I would love to be the guinea pig and spend the money for you guys and then maybe even give them to you guys. Let me know in the comments down below. Have a beautiful day. Bye, missiles. Exactly how I'm filming this right now. Ah! I don't have my tripod. So. This is so sad, I'm watching Shark Tales. <laughs>